Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. It looks like Harbor Freight has introduced a new line of automotive tools. It looks like called the Zurich, the Zurich, the Zurich, the Zurich. I don't know, but I'm going to go with Zurich. So, professional diagnostics for the master technician. It says master technicians depend on professional automotive diagnostic tools. The Zurich OBD2 code readers provide precise measurements and readings making complex vehicle diagnostic systems easy to understand and fixed. Now available at Harbor Freight Tools. So, um, last time I said Harbor Freight introduced a new item, everyone told me, that's been out for months! Where have you been? Dumbass! So, I decided to check the website, and none of these items have any reviews at all, so I feel very confident in saying this is at least somewhat new. <laughs> I've never seen them before. So, we're going to check out these things uh, real quick and uh, see what they're all about. And we'll go over to Harbor Freight here. Before I get into that, as always, you know, you guys know I have to mention my website, struggleville.net. If you haven't been there, check it out. We have all the Harbor Freight coupons, free item coupons, 20% off coupons, 25% off coupons when they're available. The 20% coupons have its own page there. I even has that have that Vulcan never expires 20% uh, off coupon. That's on the same page as the, the traditional 20% coupon. Uh, all the weekly coupons, all that. I also have my email list, so if you sign up for the email list, you never miss out on any Harbor Freight coupon. So... Had to get that out of the way. Now we're looking at the Zurich uh, line of tools here. It's four so far. And I'm not a mechanic, so I have no idea what the differences are in these damn things. But we'll look at each of them individually. But uh, another thing is, they had the old OBD2 reader that was Centec brand. And uh, I think I have that pulled up here. Yes, I do. So they have it right now for fifty four ninety seven. If this older scanner uh, still will work for whatever you need it for, I would go ahead and pick it up because if we look at my website way back in, this was published August of last year. And sometimes I like to do this just to get an idea of what past prices might have been and how things are kind of changing. The coupon price um, about six months ago was 6766 for this exact same tool and now the regular price is $54 so that's a really good deal I checked the 20 percent on um, these these uh, Zurich tools and it won't take 20 percent off of them they are excluded from the coupon however none of the 20 percent coupons because this is a new brand say anything about this Zurich thing at all. So if you're going to buy one and go in store to buy it, I'd bring a 20% off coupon. Uh, when the cashier scans it, it's going to give an error or something. But I would make the argument that there's all these excluded brands at the bottom. I do not see Zurich at the bottom. So I want my 20%. I mean, if you're getting a $190, $200 tool, 20%, you're saving 40 bucks. So um, I've had arguments for a lot less than $40 before. So anyways, I would bring in a coupon to give it a shot. I actually don't know if um, the Centec would work on a coupon or not. It looks like it would. See, I tried it. It didn't work. I even tried the Vulcan coupon just to see if they messed up or if something happened. But um, here's the 20% coupon I was using. Check this out just real quick. See if it comes off. I think it will. Yeah, it took 11 bucks off. So you can really get it for 43.98. Hell, I might have to buy that. I might buy that. Anyways, okay. So, we have the old one if you guys want to get that. But let's check out the new ones real quick. We can check out the stats. And uh, let me know in the comments below what you guys think of it. Also, let me know what the damn differences are because I don't know. We have, obviously, different prices. So, the first one is $189.99. And you can kind of categorize them. This is the ZR13 there's a ZR11, a ZR8, and a ZR4. So, um, this is the most expensive. It says OBD2 code reader with ABS. Okay, the only thing I know ABS is brakes, so I don't know. ABS, SRS, I have no idea, and fix assist, I don't know what that is either. Um, if we go to the 11 one, it just says with ABS. So, obviously, the 11 one is not doing the SRS and fix assist. And then if we go to the 8, it says code reader with live data okay i don't know what live data is either but way back in the day when i was actually in a mechanics class 
we had a thing, I think it was called All Data. And it was a computer program that had, like, just everything you could possibly know about different specific, like, makes and models of cars and wiring diagrams and all sorts of shit. So, uh, maybe that's similar, and maybe it has nothing to do with that at all, but they both have the word data in it, so that's why I brought it up. And then we go to ZR4, which just says OBD, OBD2 code reader, 59.99. So, you know, I don't know. Maybe this is the same as the Centec old version as far as what it can do. And if that's the case, maybe it's not such a good deal because this one's only 59.99. Of course, you can't get the 20% off coupon with this one. So, I don't know the best way to go. But let's look at, let's see, do do. do. So the ZR13, can we blow this up a little? Here we go. Oh, it says live real-time engine data, yes. Freeze frame data, yes. Reads OBD2, 96 and newer compatible, yes. Battery alternator test, yes. Oil light reset, yes. Battery reset, yes. Erase trouble codes, yes. I need that. My damn check engine light's been on for a year. <laughs> ABS code definitions, USA, Asia, Europe, got it. Airbag codes, yep. Fix recommendations. Oh, so fix assist is fix recommendations. Well, that's kind of interesting. It probably gives you like a uh, a yes no scenario, maybe, or is it not even going to do that? Like, do you hear this noise? Yes, no, and then it takes you like down the tree to different things. Okay, I don't know. Here's the breakdown of all the different scan things, but it's so small I can't read this. Um, okay, let's see. All four have read, clear, trouble codes, and lights. Okay, so that's all four. Emissions readiness advisor. Uh, we don't have emissions testing around here, so I don't know. Def- definitions in English and Spanish. Yeah, okay. Hot key functionality. All of them got that. View freeze frame. All of them got that. On screen code severity. All four have that. Some of these things I feel like if you're smart enough to use the tool that you don't really need some of this information, but maybe you do. So oil light reset, the ZR4 cannot do that, but the other three can. Diagnose, erase ABS codes and lights. First one cannot. Second one says D, which I don't know what that, oh, D. Domestic, oh, okay. So domestic and then DAE, DAE, which is Asian and Euro, okay. Battery alternator system check. The last three can do that. I would imagine you could just do that with a voltmeter. So, I don't know. I don't know. Why wouldn't they add that function to the easiest one? Unless it's doing something more than, I think. Uh, trip cycle procedure. Trip cycle procedure. No idea what that means. Last three are checked. Stream live data. Last three. Okay, so now we're getting down to the ones that only the most expensive two do. And that's graph and record live data. Battery reset and initialization. LED lit OBD2 cable. I think that's what it says. The last two can do it. And then the fix fix assist repair fix tips is only from the last one. And the diagnose erase SRS codes lights is uh, only on the last one also. So there you go, guys. And as I said, there are no reviews on these items. Brand spanking new. Let's see. Is there anything that we didn't cover here? Powerful, easy-to-use automotive code reader for general automotive. Blah, blah. Code reader completely understand trouble codes. Check engine light. View up to 20 critical data points at a time. Language. And I'm also looking at the most expensive one. Probably should look at the cheapest. Works with most cars, light trucks, minivans, SUVs, hybrids. Born and domestic. Fix assist instantly suggests more most likely trouble codes for check engine light problems. Diagnose and reset airbags. Oh, that's what SRS codes are for the airbags. Safety something system. Safety recovery system. I just made that up. Freeze frame shows engine condition at time the malfunction indicator light was triggered. Test battery, charger, alternator for cars that have difficulty starting. Diagnose, reset, analog brake codes. Record, graph, and playback. Live it on screen. Multi. Man, this would be nice to have. It does like a lot of stuff that would be helpful. I'm not spending $200 on it, though. 
So let's see, uh, this guy with the ABS, ABS, okay. Uh, tires, three batteries, okay. So this is going to get redundant at this point. So apparently, or obviously, this is the best one because it is the most expensive, and as you go down the tree, you are getting to least expensive and, or less expensive, and, uh, yeah. Let me see before I go, while I have you guys here, if there are any coupons available to tag onto the end of this. Alright guys, so I did see I have a whole page of coupons that I need to post and I might make a video on, but this video is already getting over 10 minutes long, so we're just going to wrap this thing up. So thanks for watching. Make sure to give the video a like, subscribe if you're not already a subscriber, and check out these tools on uh, the Zurich, Zurich uh, tool brand here that Harbor Freight has probably had out for a year, and I just noticed it and making a whole video calling it new, and it's been out forever. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching, guys.